पंजाब केसरी नव उदय टाइम्स में आज की हमारी खास मेहमान है द क्वीन ऑफ हार्ट सनी लियोनी हु इज हियर रेडी टू होस्ट येट अनदर सीजन ऑफ इंडिया लॉन्गेस्ट रनिंग रियलिटी शो स्प्लिट्स विला एंड इट इज हियर विद स्प्लिट्स विला एक्स फाइव एक यूनिक कॉन्सेप्ट इस बार है क्या है क्या चीजें होंगी डिफरेंट व्हाट शुड वी एक्सपेक्ट बहुत सारी बातें सनी से करेंगे बट फर्स्ट थिंग्स फर्स्ट सनी अ वॉम वॉम वेलकम टू यू ऑन आर प्लेटफॉर्म थैंक यू सो मच फॉर हैविंग मी the pleasure is all ours because of course you've got a huge fan base amongst the youth and uh, obviously you host this show which is about the youth so i want to know as an audience what should i expect from this season this season is completely different from every other season the the concept itself um is something i in my head i pictured something when they told me the concept and what happened um on set and while we were shooting was something completely different um this year is a complete emotional roller coaster for not only the contestants but everybody who watched even myself even Tanuj um when we were watching all these things happen and unfold it was something i mean you literally were watching someone just break from the inside in certain situations emotionally and you know there's so many different emotions that go into having contestants and then we brought in the exes and you know it was you know there are exes for a reason <laughs> <laughs> uh, most of them um and then there were some where you know you genuinely feel like hey maybe they made a mistake and they're here to reconcile so it was it was very interesting right and in fact you know bahut sari cheeze is got different hai as you said uh, from the concept of introducing the exes also there was this uh, you know the song that you all shot for the theme song that looked very interesting and fun to shoot so wo kaisa experience tha uh it was it was a lot of fun and um during the show they would play the song over and over again and i think it just kind of you know got into our brains and our heads and it got more catchy as as time went by and it was so much fun um shooting that video and i think it turned out really cute right but sunny tell me you hosted quite a few seasons of the show now does it become uh, you know a little boring that you know ki concept kya hai you know of course contestants alag honge har baar lekin aapko pata hai ki acha aisa hoga phir aisa hoga or every time you go with new renewed energy absolutely renewed and new energy because every season has different contestants and you can't predict people's emotions and you can't predict who's going to do well or you know how people are going to react to certain situations and maybe some things yes are similar because when it comes to young beautiful sexy smart people um there's certain things that we do as youngsters that are repeated we see these same patterns but what we don't see is people's reactions to certain things or how they handle um you know these challenges how they're forced each person has their own life journey that's never the same and so it's always it's always something different and bringing in the exes was like we just dropped a bomb and <laughs> <laughs> in the middle of our dome session um in in that episode right uh, but you know when we've seen uh, the past season so one thing commonly that stands out is how you conduct yourself with all the participants chahe aapka bond ho unke sath chahe women rights ki baat ho phir chahe you know reprimand karna ho unko when you know things don't go right or when they are in the wrong yeah. i did a lot of that this year oh my gosh <laughs> <laughs> but tell me how do you build this connection with the contestants that they don't see you as somebody who's just a host but as a member of you know the whole uh, totality i don't know it's just it's me no <laughs> <laughs> um you know i i meet them with the intentions of no expectations and go in there and meet these young people and they're all young and beautiful and they're all smart in their own way they all have their own things going on in their lives and that i find interesting i find human behavior very interesting <laughs> so watching them getting to know them of course you know you get very emotionally involved with a lot of people i think that if you don't get emotionally involved it's very difficult then to 
kind of enjoy the process. And that's something that I enjoyed from the very beginning, which is why this is my ninth season (laughs) um, hosting the show is that I get really involved. And um, as each season passes, even more so involved and, you know, involved, you know, and how, you know, they want to have that certain episode go through or certain opinions about certain things. And I do like standing my ground on certain situations that I think are wrong. And there were a lot of those things that happened this year because each generation is different. I find that as each generation goes on, they're a little bit less inhibited in how they speak. Um, (laughs) So (laughs) sometimes when they speak, they're a little bit politically incorrect or they say something that I know for a fact um and most people will agree that maybe we should not say those things there's enough hate in the world we should um try and love each other with some of the comments that we pass to each other but other than the fighting and like not agreeing on um how things are going in the show that's free game but yeah there was a lot of (laughs) there was a lot of things that happened this year but sunny as a host who's like largely supposed to be neutral and you know um be with everybody and take the game forward are you allowed to have your personal favorites well i don't know if it's as favorites but there's people that you when you're watching them um you like them for different reasons Mm -hmm. so it's like uh, i don't know how to explain this without using my kids as a reference (laughs) i love them all equally but they're all very different and you know the same thing with the contestants is that when you're watching them, you pull things out out of each of the care each of the contestants that you like, or you you're like, okay, maybe you you know should not be saying these things, or you know, some of my main things with the contestants were that some of the things that they said, I don't think that we should be saying those things out loud. Um, so that was about that was about it with them. Right. But the, I love them all. They're and you so have cute. a new host this season. So the host is new to the season, but he's not ho- new to you as a co-worker. So how is it working again with Tanuj? Yeah, you know, when you shoot a film with somebody, you're you have like your people around, your guards are up a little bit, you're working, you're in your character. Um, you're not always together for long amounts of time on set. And that's one of the biggest difference between shooting, you know, a show or a a film uh, and a reality show. So with Splits Villa, we we were together 24 hours almost, except we were (laughs) sleeping. Um, And we would be together on set all day long. We'd joke all day long and we would react to the different challenges or things that were happening. So I got to know Tanuj a little bit more on this, a lot more about his personality and how he is and his family and everything. So that I enjoyed a lot. And we really gelled together. We gelled together when we worked together on a film. So this was just us having so much fun together. And I really do look forward to, you know, our future, like our families getting together and, and, Mm -hmm. you know, spending time. Right. So this is one of the longest running reality shows in India that we have. So what do you reason for this huge fan base that it has in this sustainability? Well, babies are born every day and <laughs> the next generation is always watching, always interested. And I think, you know, these these contestants that come on, they're so young and they really are our future role models um, for this younger generation and the things that they relate with are the same things that you know all these other young people relate to so I think the relatability factor is huge and then also there's a lot of like when we say we're watching a train wreck or you know seeing you know something happen and then you just get glued to watching um them make mistakes make good mistakes the things that they're saying and liking each other hating each other whatever it is um, so I think we get glued to the idea of beautiful, young, sexy people making all these crazy choices. Right. But you know, a lot of people who critic show, you know, who are there to uh, pinpoint at things that are not so good. They always say, ki, you know, with as the seasons are passing, abhi log yahan par 
इसलिए भी आ रहे हैं क्योंकि इंस्टेंट फेम मिल जाता है फ्यूर इन स्प्लिट्स विला बिकॉज यू आर रिकोगनाइज बिकॉज यू आर वॉच इन सो मेनी कंट्रीज um so do you think that takes away from the basic charm or the basic concept of the show um i don't think that can you just repeat that question one more time yeah i said there are a lot of people who say that up contestants isle bhi aate hain kyunki unhe instant fame chahiye because you know splits villa ki recognize ho jate hain usme aane se so do you think this takes away from the basic concept of the show that it's about people to fall in love I think that when you're put in a situation like Splits Villa where you have no phones, no TV, no newspaper, no Instagram, no social media, um no friends, no family and you're put in this bubble with a bunch of other really good-looking people, regardless of your intent, you are going to feel emotions, you are going to feel things towards other people. Um you know these guys and these girls get together and all of a sudden they are connecting on a emotional level um more than physical cuz we all promote the physical <laughs> 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 um, so they're connect- they might i don't know about it don't ask me. <laughs> um but they're connecting with each other on an emotional level and so what happens is is regardless of what your intent was in the beginning something else happens because you forget the camera is there you forget that it's rolling and then you get caught up in a moment and that's your true self so um there are rare i think rare people who go on reality television shows and are completely 100% aware of what they're doing and how they're doing it and their plan of how to get that fame. So of course fame comes your own a television show that caters to millions and millions of people over I think it's like 26 different countries. Um so of course uh you know that you're going to get fame but um their emotions are pretty raw and they're pretty real. Correct. And I think this is another reason hai for the show to be the longest running reality show that people can, you know, see that uh, emotion and the reality and the relatability, of course. Um, but if you had to sum this season up, as you said, there are a lot of things that are different, hongi, and you know, the uh, audience is in for a lot of entertainment and uh, twists and turns. If you have to sum it up in one sentence for us to watch it and not miss it, what would it be, Sunny? It's like a tsunami, tornado, earthquake <laughs> that all landed. in the middle of udaipur <laughs> um uh, i think that this season is one of our most emotionally uh, emotional seasons um to date and um the mix between contestants and exes are something that is it's going to be unforgettable for people to watch yeah so really looking forward to that and wishing you all the luck for the success of the season and all your future projects sunny and thank you so So much for talking to you. Thank you. Have a nice day.